we are asked to use the given diagram to indicate whether each statement is true or false. Let's begin by reviewing the definition of a subset as well as a proper subset. A subset of a set A is another set that contains only elements from set A. A subset can contain all elements of A. So if B is a subset of A, all the elements of B are in set A, and the two sets could be identical, and we state B is a subset of A using this notation here. It might be helpful to think of the less than or equal to inequality symbol. A proper subset is a subset that is not identical to the original set. It contains fewer elements. So if B is a proper subset of A, all the elements of B are in set A, but the two sets cannot be identical, or we can say B has less elements in A, which we indicate using this notation here, and we state B is a proper subset of A. And again, it might be helpful to think of the less than inequality symbol. So looking at the given statements, we first have B is a proper subset of A. So looking at the diagram, notice how all the elements of B are in set A, and the two sets are not identical, or we can say B has fewer elements, and therefore B is a proper subset of A is true. Next we have C is a proper subset of A. Once again, notice how all the elements of C are in set A, and the two sets are not identical, or C has less elements than A, and therefore C is the proper subset of A is true. And the last statement is B is a proper subset of C. Well, notice how in this case, all the elements of B are not in set C, and therefore B is not a subset or a proper subset of C, and therefore B is a proper subset of C is false. I hope you found this helpful.